Hello YouTube. All right, let's go ahead and put an RC up on that table. All right, let's see what we got here. Today, we got the WPL C24-1. It's out of here. There it is. Ready, let's do an unboxing. And we are the crazy quad brothers. P3. All right, hello YouTube. Welcome everybody to the channel. All right, uh, today I've been wanting one of these for a while. Uh, anyways, we got the WPL C24-1. Uh, went ahead and got a two battery version. Um, the original battery, you know, should last 20 to 30 minutes. And then the second battery, another 20 to 30 minutes. So all in all, you know, get about an hour of runtime between the two batteries. But uh, these are pretty decent on batteries. Not like your, you know, typical cars where you get like 8 to 10 minutes out of or whatever because it's flying so fast. But anyways, these are a lot slower. And uh, they're meant for crawling, climbing, etc. Very popular on the market. Uh, a lot of people upgrade these. So let's see here. All right. Let's take this puppy out of the box. All right. Anyways, uh, looks like we got a, sorry, got a quick little instruction manual, which is for the C24 and the C24K uh, truck. Anyways, looks like uh, basically explains how to use a little simple USB charger. Uh, shows what it comes with, you know, got the truck, got the remote control battery, but I have two of them. Uh, manual, uh, access, you know, accessories, has uh, stickers that comes with it and a little charger. <clears throat> uh, the battery ends up fitting under the back, but we'll look at that here in a minute. <clears throat> uh, I can't read Chinese, so I'll skip that. But anyways, uh, shows the operation method, how to use the remote control, what does what, which direction does it make the car go, etc. Now it should have trim buttons on it and everything. But let's go ahead and put this to the side and take a look at what we got here. We got tape. All right. There's my second battery. <clears throat> Oops, I'm sorry. Anyways. Right there, uh, WPL 14500, 500 milliamp, 7.4. See extra battery that came with it. The other battery should be in the vehicle. So, this is the ready to run version. There is also another version which you can put together yourself. Um, I don't feel like doing that. So I got the ready to run version, but anyways, this is a nice, uh, feels pretty, pretty solid. Uh, 1 16th scale truck. Uh, anyways, uh, here's the remote. Uh, looks like it's it's got uh, for right and left, as far as for your, uh, probably your, that should be for your trim. Uh, on and off switch. Should take, um, uh, gotta unscrew it right there. Uh, should be, <clears throat> take it off there. Should be uh, two AAA batteries that go in there. Very light, cheap plastic remote. Uh, no foam on there, but you know, who cares? <clears throat> uh, for the price these things run at. Anyways, uh, comes with a bunch of little accessories. It's got the door handles you put on there. And uh, got the mirror you put on there, the signal. The lights are actually LED lights that light up. Uh, got the underbody right here, uh, which a lot of people upgrade a bunch of stuff because all this is plastic parts that comes with this. A lot of people get all metal stuff. Some people go really crazy and uh, dump a lot of money into these things, which is in its own right because you know a lot of these parts are plastic. You know, it's fine. But uh, if you really get into it, I mean, as far as uh, the shocks, you know, are, are little little spring shocks, which you can go ahead and put some oil-filled shocks in there. 
and uh, <clears throat> can go ahead and you know pretty much replace every because this is you know like real cheap little plastic and stuff like that you know but there's a bunch of uh, metal suspension parts you can put on these which I'm probably gonna go ahead and upgrade this one and uh, diff caps you can you know put a uh, metal diff caps on there you can you know everything all the steering <coughs> excuse me uh, so there's a bunch of upgradable parts on here but for the price um, this is hard to beat. Um, the battery, the original battery should be right under here. So like I said, this is a two battery version. Um, plug right there. I forgot what type of plug that is, but, uh, some people go ahead and, uh, change out the plug on there also to go along with other, you know, chargers that they might have, uh, might do that or might just keep it how it is. And, you know, it, it, it depends. There's there's a world of things I could go ahead and do to this. It just depends what I want to go ahead and do. But uh, anyways, in here also it's got a bunch of little stickers that you can go ahead and stick on the side as far as uh, the, you know, taillight stickers, side stickers. <clears throat> you know, you can even, you know, even a license plate. You know, people put uh, a winch on these things. People go insane with these things. These are a lot of fun. Looks like the power switch is right here which makes it accessible. You don't have to reach under anything. But uh, anyways, these tires, I've heard these tires aren't the greatest. Uh, I went ahead and, you know, already got some upgraded tires to go ahead and uh, stick on there. <clears throat> I'll have to go ahead and, you know, put an overlay picture on here, right here, of which tires I'm gonna stick on there. But uh, anyways, Awesome little truck. Uh, this is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, 124 scale, I like 124 scale. Uh, got a couple of different uh, crawlers and, you know, trail trucks and whatever like that. But uh, 116 scale, this should be a lot of fun because you can do stuff indoors. You can do stuff uh, outdoors. Obviously, uh, there's a bunch of videos on these. Uh, at some point, I will have, you know, some run videos up. But probably going to run this with the stock tires at first just to see what it does. And then uh, go ahead and put uh, put the upgraded on there. So anyways, thank you for watching my unboxing. Have a very wonderful day.